so in this video, I'm gonna be talking about the nine signs that women are finding you more attractive and that you are becoming more of a handsome and attractive man overall as you continue to go down your looks maxing and body game journey. So with that being said, I'm gonna be going over nine crucial signs that women are starting to notice you more, they're starting to find you more handsome and attractive, and that your looks maxing and body game journey are paying off. With that being said, all the nine signs I'm gonna be diving into in today's video, they're all gonna be backed up by the experiences that my clients are having that are all inside of my Inbound Attraction Blueprint program, and they are starting to experience these levels of attraction and better treatment and just overall becoming more noticeable to women based on what they've been implementing from my Inbound Attraction Blueprint blueprint program. So be sure that you stay throughout the entire video because you don't want to miss any of these signs because if you miss any of these signs, then you might be missing out on an opportunity where a woman is showcasing interest and attraction to you that you could maximize. But if you don't know about the sign, then you can't maximize that opportunity. So before we do hop into the nine signs, if you want to level up your looks, if you want to become the most handsome and attractive version of yourself, and you want to start attracting women to you on autopilot consistently, predictably, and reliably every single single day, whether that's through dating apps, social media, or girls even coming up to you in person and having amazing interactions with women overall, just like how you're going to see my clients experiencing these interactions and these results with women, then I would highly suggest that you check out my free IAB training. I'll have it linked down below in the description and the pinned comment. Check it out after this video. So with that being said, let's go ahead and let's dive into it. So the first sign, and I have all these screenshots from my clients are inside the inbound attraction blueprint, but I'm gonna block out their face and their name for privacy reasons. But the first sign is that women are noticing your body transformation. So women who you may be around quite often, like coworkers or even girls that you see at the gym, they're gonna notice your body transformation if you're dialing in your physique and you're practicing body game. So they're going to begin complimenting you on your physical improvements that you're making to your body. Whether you are on a fat loss journey and you're starting to lose a bunch of weight because you're cutting right now and you're trying to just lean down, or let's say that you're skinny and you're starting to pack on lean muscle mass because you're on a lean bulk, either way, you're going to start seeing that women are going to take notice of your physical transformation when it comes to your body. And that is a good sign that not only are you making progress, but they're noticing you more and they find you more physically attractive. And I even experienced this myself when I used to work at Target stocking shelves overnight. When I started to lean bulk and pack on more muscle mass, women that I was working with started to notice. They started to compliment me. They would say things like, oh, Jordan, look at your arms. Like, they look so good. Or you you look like you're packing on muscle. Like, you look great. I'll get compliments like that. So just understand, man, women are going to be checking for you. They are going to be peeping you. And they're very observant. They notice things about you, even when you don't think that they do. And it's not necessarily that men are invisible to women. They notice all the men, but they more so keep an eye out on the men that they find physically attractive, if that makes sense. So with that being said, just keep that in mind that women are gonna start noticing your body transformation. Again, whether you're leaning down to lose weight or you're packing on lean muscle mass because you're on a lean bulk, either way, women are gonna notice and they're gonna compliment you on your physique as you start to improve it and dial it in. So that's the first sign is that women are gonna be noticing your body transformation. So moving on to number two, is that women are just gonna outright compliment you on your looks. So like right here, what my client said, he said, look forward to it, yes sir, still on my weight loss grind and still getting comments from my female coworkers on how good I look. So women have no problem outright complimenting you on how good you look. A lot of men think that women are very egotistical in the sense where they won't give a man compliments or give him his credit. Now, of course, there are some women like that for sure, but if women do find you attractive, man, they're going to let you know. They don't mind letting the men that they find physically attractive that they are into, for the most part, they don't mind giving that man a compliment and letting them know that woman finds that man attractive because she's into him, right? And because she's into him, she wants to make that known to him by giving him a compliment on his looks, for example. And like I said in the last point, women are very observant and they notice all the men. It's just they're not going to give the attention or energy or their time, effort or anything like that to the men that they don't find attractive. That's just what it is. I'm not trying to sound like an a-hole or a jerk when I say that, but that's just the truth of the matter, right? And this means that they are observant. This proves my point that they are observant 
and that once you start to improve your looks, you start to dial in your facial aesthetics, your body, you're going to begin to start to stand out to the women that maybe weren't giving you time, attention, or noticing you in the sense of just showcasing attention to you by talking to you, having a conversation with you or whatever, you're gonna notice that you're gonna actually start to stand out to these women, right? They're gonna start to talk to you more. They're gonna start to say hello to you more. They're gonna start to compliment you on your physical transformation, whether that's your face, your body, et cetera. You're going to overall start to stand out to them a lot more. And this is a pretty good indicator that there is physical attraction there because women don't just hand out compliments to men like candy. They're not going to just hand out compliments to any and all type of men. They're going to be very selective to who they give a compliment to because they know most men are creeps, right? Like they don't want to give the men that they're not attracted to the wrong idea that they could be interested in them if they give them a compliment, right? Women know this. Women know that most dudes are creeps. Women know that most dudes are thirsty for them, et cetera. So they're going to be very selective to who they compliment, right? Because they don't want the creepy, thirsty dude that they don't find attractive. They want the man that they're into that they find attractive. So they're going to be selective to who they compliment, which is a good indicator that there is physical attraction there. So that's the second sign is that women are going to be complimenting you on your looks. They're going to be just straightforward about it. And Again, for the most part, most women aren't going to have an ego to them when it comes to complimenting you on your looks if they are physically into you and attracted to you. That's number two. Moving on to number three is that women will smile at you and give you long stares. This message from a client of mine, he said, man, I've been getting more smiles and attention from women ever since I've been on the weight loss grind, bro. I'm used to being ignored by women, but now I'm getting way more smiles and long stares from women. So Women will flash smiles at you and even stare at you because you are becoming more attractive. Women don't just smile or just stare at any and all type of men. I know that kind of sounds repetitive from the last point, but it's true. Like, again, women know the dudes who are thirsty. They know the dudes that they don't find physically attractive and they don't want to give the wrong impression. They don't want to give off the wrong sign. Now, there are going to be girls who are just nice, right? They just have nice personalities. They're just kind. They're kind to everyone. They can give off the wrong impression unintentionally to a lot of men because a lot of men think that, oh, this girl, she's talking to me, being nice to me. That automatically means that she's attracted to me, right? But if the dude doesn't have it like that in the sense where he's not fly, he doesn't look good, his body isn't dialed in, he hasn't done any type of improvements to his face or anything like that, but also the girl isn't truly giving indicators that she's really into him, which we'll talk more about throughout this video. She could just be nice because that's just how her personality is, right? But women, again, for the most part, they're gonna be selective with the men that they give this type of attention, validation, if you will, positive energy, and smiling at specific men or staring at specific men. Like a a woman isn't gonna be staring at you if she doesn't find you physically attractive. Let's just keep it a stack. They're not gonna do that. So if you're experiencing that women who maybe used to pass up on you in the sense of just not talking to you, not speaking to you, coming off as if she doesn't notice you, coming off as if you are invisible to you, and or maybe if you have talked to her before, like whether this was a coworker or a girl that you've seen at the gym or just a girl that you're seeing frequently for whatever reason, if you've seen that in the past, she hasn't given you much interest before, but now she's starting to showcase more interest in you. Now she's starting to give you attention. Now she's starting to have a conversation with you. She's even starting to smile at you. And if you peep her staring at you, like whenever you look at her, she's staring at you, you look away, and then you look back at her and she, she, you catch her staring at you, but then she quickly looks away or looks down and looks back up at you. Those are also, in the sense, forms of choosing signals. It, it depends on the context, but those can also be forms of choosing signals. But again, these are good indicators that they find you physically attractive because especially if a woman smiles at you, it's because they're associating a positive emotion with you by simply looking at you. They could be fantasizing about things in regards to you, imagining things about you, right? Overall, you're creating some type of positive emotion within her to make her want to smile at you, right? And again, if they're staring at you, it's because they find you physically attractive and they like what they're seeing. So that's the third sign is that women will smile at you and give you long stares as you begin to become more handsome and attractive on your looks maxing and body game journey. So moving on to number four, women are gonna go out of their way to say hi to you 
and start a conversation. So this client said, absolutely. What's crazier is that I'm getting more attention from random people saying hi and being more nice to me. I'm like, WTF, I'm not used to this. So if you're noticing that women who are who you're often around are starting to say hi more, like I said in the last point, they're starting conversations with you, right? They're going out of their way to say hi. They're going out of their way to start conversations with you, right? And again, maybe they used to not give you any type of attention in the past or any type of interest like that. This means that you are becoming more noticeable to them because your looks are improving. Your looks are becoming more attractive to them, whether that's your face, your body. Overall, you're just becoming more physically attractive, aesthetic, and pleasing to their eye. And this is just a really good indicator, man. Like I said, that you're making progress and this should be more so of an encouragement for you, right? This should be a great indicator of, hey, you've been putting in the work and now it's starting to pay off. Keep going, keep improving, keep dialing in your face, keep dialing in your body as far as a skincare routine, grooming, leaning down, packing on lean muscle mass, just doing everything that you can to improve your looks to the best of your ability. And with the genetics that you were given, just keep going because the work is paying off. The hard work is paying off, right? You're also going to notice that people are going to start to treat you better. They're going to start to treat you better because it's just the fact of the matter is, man, is that the more attractive you are, the better people treat you by and large and they view you in a higher light or I don't even know if that makes sense, but they view you in a higher regard in the sense of them associating positive traits with you because you are a good looking man to them, right? And this can be men and women. Like men will want to be friends with you if you're jacked, you're in shape, you look good, you take care of yourself. Men want to be friends with men like that because they know for the most part that a man like that looks good, everything about him is dialed in, right? His face, his body, his fashion, all that stuff. They know that man gets women, so they're gonna wanna be associated with him because of that. And another reason why men will wanna be friends with these type of men, they won't admit this because of their ego and pride and they don't wanna come off soft or anything like that, but they are inspired by these men. So they want to be associated with these type of men, they wanna be friends with these type of men because they are inspired by them and they want to have the same type of results that they have. And then of course, when it comes to women, women treat the men that they find attractive just better than the men that they don't find attractive. That's just, it is what it is. And we all do that really if we think about it for the most part. Now, I don't think you should be like that. I really think you should be, for us men, I think that we should be cool and just treat people equally. I know it's, maybe it's easier said than done for sure, especially like with an attractive woman, like how you're gonna treat an attractive woman you're gonna treat her differently than how you treat a woman that maybe you don't find attractive. But really, if you are a type of man that treats everybody equally, you're actually gonna be more attractive from a personality standpoint, from a charisma standpoint, because you're just gonna come off more humble, right? You're gonna come off more down to earth. And people like those type of people, man. Especially if you pair that up with good looks. Like if you're a good looking man, but you're also just a solid dude, You treat people with respect. You are kind to people, unless they give you a reason not to, right? But you are respectful and kind to everybody. It doesn't matter how they look, what they do. It doesn't matter, right? But if you treat everyone the same and you're a good looking dude, bro, I'm telling you, the world is gonna be your oyster. So just understand that as you improve your looks, women are gonna go out of their way to say hi to you and start a conversation with you. And if these are women that haven't done this before, but now they're starting to do it, it's because they notice you, they notice that you are improving, that you're becoming more handsome and attractive and that they are starting to find you physically attractive. So that's number four. Moving on to number five, women will notice your facial aesthetics improving. So let me read this message from my client right here. He said, I got a comment from my female coworker that my face looked different yesterday. I've been using your skincare that you have in the IAB and face exercises. And then I said, bro, I'm telling you it works. And then I said, did she point out what it was or did she just simply say that it looked different? I'm just asking what specifically about his face did she notice? And then he said, that'd be the only thing that changed. She said, I just looked different. Before I was pretty much invisible, like high and by. She made no comments about my looks or anything. So that tells you doing the work I've done has already made a dramatic change in how people treat me. So just like I said in the last point, people are gonna treat you better, right? So women will begin to see that your facial aesthetics are improving and becoming more attractive if this is a woman like in a job setting, a woman that you see frequently and often, they're gonna notice that you are improving. That's what I'm saying, man. Women are observant. Women do notice 
the men around them. They're just not going to showcase the attention and the energy and the attraction to the men that they don't find physically attractive. Like it's just as simple as that. And when it comes to improving your overall facial aesthetics and attractiveness, this can mean many different things. But like how my client said, he's been using my skincare routine inside my inbound attraction blueprint program. So this can mean that your skin is getting clearer, your jawline is getting sharper and defined because your face is leaning down. Maybe you're lining up your beard in a way that just makes you have more angularity and definition to your face. You're growing out facial hair that is well kept, it's well groomed. Maybe it's to a stubble, to maybe a high stubble or like a medium beard, but just overall, you're looking a lot more attractive, you're lean, you're defined, and you look masculine too, which women love all of those physical traits when it comes to the face specifically. And I know I've been hitting hard on this point, but this just proves that women do notice the men around them. Women are very observant. So if they're starting to see that you're making physical improvements and then they're starting to compliment you on your physical improvements. That means that they've seen you before, that they noticed you before as far as your physical looks, but at that point they didn't find you attractive, right? Maybe you just weren't doing it for them. But then now as you starting to put in the work, now they're noticing, now there's, there's changes going on, right? They're starting to see that you're getting leaner, that your face looks a lot better, it looks a lot more clear. It looks a lot more defined. Your body is starting to pack on lean muscle mass. It's, it's starting to become more proportionate. It's looking more masculine. It's vascular, right? Again, women pick up on these things, man. And if they find you physically attractive and if they like what they see, they're gonna let you know that they do. So that's number five. Women will notice your facial aesthetics improving. So moving on to number six, women will start to give their numbers to you. Now there's context to this that we're gonna talk about, but let me read these messages that I got from my clients. So he said, hit 295 pounds this morning and got a chick's phone number when I went to the dollar store. What the F man, LOL. Random people, men and women are starting conversations with me and finally able to fit into XL shirts again. So this gentleman right here is on a weight loss journey and he's been leaning down quite a bit ever since he joined my program and started watching my content. He's absolutely killing it. And he said, I was just getting some water this morning post-workout at the store and the cashier was being super friendly and talkative, I noticed with me. But the guy before me was short and dry but with me, she was smiling and asking me questions about myself and I got the number and bounce. So basically he was saying that when this cashier chick was talking to my client, she was super friendly, talkative. But before, when she was talking to the guy that was in line before my client, the same cashier was dry and short with that dude. So here's the thing. There's context to a woman giving you her number because a lot of dudes, what they're gonna do is they're gonna cold approach a woman, wear her down and she'll usually give her number to the guy just to really get rid of him. And usually it's either a fake number or she'll give him her actual number but won't respond to him, maybe even block him. So when it comes to a woman giving you her number, look at the context behind this. Is she showing good energy and interest in you? Just like how my client said, the cashier chick was being super friendly and talkative to him. Whereas in comparison to the person that she was talking to before my client, she was short and dry. You see what I'm saying? Is she asking questions about you? Is she invested in the conversation with you to the point where there's a natural back and forth? Is she just overall enthusiastic, optimistic, bubbly, if that's her personality? Is she feeling all these positive emotions when she's talking to you? Can you tell that she's enjoying the conversation with you? Because if she's showcasing these type of traits and these type of behaviors to you, that's a pretty good sign that she's interested in you and has attraction towards you, especially with this particular scenario where Again, this same cashier chick was treating the man differently that was in front of my client at the cashier line. She was treating that man differently than how she was treating my client. She was super friendly and talkative and invested in the conversation with my client, but then the guy before she wasn't. So with that blatant comparison, this tells you that women will give their numbers to you, but in this type of context, if they're showcasing these type of positive behaviors, they will give their number to you because they are interested in you and that there's physical attraction there, not because they're trying to get rid of you. So just keep that in mind. But that's the sixth sign is that women will start giving their numbers to you. So number seven, women and supervisor positions will compliment you on your body. So this is another uh, message from a client of mine. He said, every week, bro, my supervisor is commenting on how good my body looks. And female boss said to me last week about how she noticed how much weight I lost. Body game is undefeated. So 
women, again, in supervisor positions or just simply higher up positions in the workforce will even take notice of your physical changes and improvements. And the reason why I want you to pay attention to this, because I think this is funny, is that if a supervisor is complimenting you on your body, that's actually a big deal in my opinion, because since they are in a higher ranked position, since they are in a supervisor position, they could get in trouble for making these type of comments if let's say my client were, were to report the supervisor, right? They could in a sense get in trouble because that's a lack of professionalism right? That, that, that's not professional conduct. You see what I'm saying? And that can actually be harassment. If, it, if the, let's just be honest, if the roles were reversed in this scenario, that would be considered harassment. If the person were to report the supervisor for making a comment like that, let's just keep it a stack. Pay attention to these little details because women in these type of positions, they know the type of consequences that they could have and experience if they were to make comments like this. So that tells you that you are making a lot of progress when it comes to improving your overall looks and more specifically when it comes to your body, that's how you know that you're improving. That's how you know women are noticing your physical changes and that they are finding you more attractive because if they're willing to give you compliments about your looks and your overall physicality, knowing that since they are in a higher ranked position, that they could get in trouble for doing so due to misconduct, not being professional. And that again, could even be considered harassment if again, my client were to report this supervisor. Like even with understanding all these things and knowing all these things, they're still making compliments. They're still saying something about your body. That's how you know that you're making positive changes and improvements with your physique and that you're becoming more handsome and attractive. And this is exactly why all men need to be dialing in their physique and practice body game. And body game is just simply being able to attract women with your physique, right? You're gonna be standing out to women a lot more as you've been seeing in the screenshots of the messages from my clients. You're gonna be able to stand out to them a lot more from a physicality aspect. You're gonna be more attractive to them. You're gonna be arousing them. You're gonna be attracting them to you by them starting conversations with you, by them complimenting you. This is what I'm saying. This is why I'm all about inbound game, women coming to you because the women that come to you are the best type of women because they have a high interest and attraction in you. So instead of you having to go to them and you having to try to convince them to like you, they come to you and they are convincing you that they like you. They're letting you know that they like you. They're letting you know that they have high interest in you. You just have to pick up on these signs, which is exactly why I made this video. But that's number seven, women in supervisor positions will compliment you on your body. So moving on to number eight, women will tell you that they are inspired by you and will start to ask about your diet or your workout plan. So let's look at this message real quick. This client of mine, he said, the women at my job are inspired by me and always asking what I eat or work out. So as you begin to improve as a man, you can inspire others to make positive changes, even women, right? Even women will be inspired by you when you are dialing in your physique, when you are on a good workout routine, when you have a good diet plan in place and you start to make positive changes and you're becoming more attractive, you won't just inspire men, but you will also inspire women. And this is a good sign that women find you physically attractive if they start to ask about your diet, if they start to ask about what you're eating, how you're losing weight, right? How are you getting more toned, as they will say? You know what I mean? They'll start to ask questions about that. And the reason why they're asking questions about that is because you look good to them. Nobody asks about the diet plan or the workout routine of someone that is out of shape and doesn't look good, especially women. And like I've been saying throughout this video, women are very selective to who they give this type of energy and attention to. They're going to be selective with the type of men that they give their sexual attention to, their sexual energy to, their validation to, right? They're gonna be very selective because they know most men are creeps and thirsty and they don't wanna give the men that they're not attracted to the wrong idea or the wrong impression. So if they're asking you these type of questions, it's because they think that you look good and that you are improving your body, that you are improving your looks and that you're making overall amazing progress. And depending on the context, this can also be a roundabout way of them expressing interest in you. This can be a subtle way of them letting you know that they find you physically attractive by making a compliment about your body, but they're doing it in a roundabout way by asking about your diet, asking about your workout routine. Like I've had women that would ask me to personally train them, right? Like they would slide up on my Instagram stories when I would post like a shirtless photo of me working out. They would ask me if I can personally train them. 
which is just a way of them letting me know that they find me physically attractive and that they want to get together with me, right? That's really what they're saying there. They're going to be a lot more covert with how they feel about you and their physical interest in you. But depending on the context, this can be a roundabout way of them expressing interest in you. And in large part, this is the case, right? This is the case that they do find you physically attractive. So keep that in mind is that women are going to be inspired by you and ask about your diet and workout plan as you are dialing in your physique. So that's number eight. And then moving on to the last and final sign, sign number nine is that you will experience the halo effect from women. So let me read this conversation that I've had with a client. He said, absolutely, man. My goal is completely do a 180 once I reach the weight loss goal to show people that you can go from rock bottom to success as long as you put in the work. You weren't lying about the halo effect. I have female coworkers treating me like a total 180 being more nicer to me. And I said, hell yeah, bro. I'm loving your testimonies. You're killing it. What all have they been saying slash doing differently? He said, absolutely, man. Just smiling at me more, creating more conversations with me. Before, it was like I was invisible. They would just say hi and bye. Now it's like forcing conversations and asking more about me. So, guys, this is what I'm saying. As you begin to level up your looks, your face, your body, your grooming, your fashion, everything, you're going to, as I've been saying throughout this video, you're going to be noticing that women will take more notice and interest in you more. They will compliment you when they start to see that you are making positive changes when it comes to your overall physical presentation and they're going to treat you better right this is the halo effect when you become more attractive men and women will begin to treat you better as i said earlier on in this video because they are associating positive traits with you because of how you look externally and i'm just going to be honest man life can become a lot easier for you in terms of how people treat and view you as you begin to improve your overall physical attractiveness. That's just a factor of the matter. That's just human nature. You can be upset about it. You can feel a certain way about it. That's a whole different conversation, but is this the truth? By and large, this is how you're gonna be treated by people. This is human nature. And you're gonna have an easier time adapting to human nature and using it to your advantage instead of trying to go against human nature and try to fight a battle or a war that you can't win. But this is what I'm saying. You're going to experience the halo effect. You're going to experience the halo effect for men and women. But when it comes to women and picking up on signs that they find you attractive and that they're into you and that you are making progress on your looks maxing and body game journey, you're going to notice that women will treat you a lot better overall. They're going to be a lot more nicer, a lot more sweeter, a lot more talkative. They're going to showcase just more positive and feminine energy to you. They're just going to overall treat you better and view you in a higher regard than other men because you are just a more handsome and attractive man. So with that being said, guys, those are the nine signs that women are finding you to be more handsome and attractive and that you are making amazing progress on your looks maxing and body game journey. And like I said at the beginning of this video, if you want to maximize your looks and become the most handsome and attractive version of yourself and you want to start experiencing these type of interactions and treatment and behaviors that my clients inside of IAB are experiencing as a byproduct of becoming the most handsome and attractive version of themselves to the point where they are attracting women to them and just being treated like kings, then I would highly suggest that you check out my free IAB training. Again, I'll have a link down below in the description and the pinned comment. And if you got a lot of value from this video, please give it a like, subscribe for more videos like this, and let me know down below if you've experienced any of these signs as well. I'd be curious to know your experiences and your stories. So with that being said, I appreciate you watching and I'll see you in the next video.